Hey, good morning, everyone. So we're in the Zenders parking lot, and just take a look. Uh, we are surrounded by all these blocks of snow, and it's really awesome to see that they start here, and then in just a few days, they're going to be totally different. And uh, we have a carver here with us this morning, John Martinez, and uh, he's getting to work pretty early here for us this morning. And uh, in our last hit, we were talking about how you were honoring an old friend, and and here's just an, uh, Dale's getting a look at what their finished product will look like. It's that hand with the two tube of toothpaste. Uh, tell us, uh, how long have you been a carver? Uh, I've been carving for about 27 years. All right, what got you into that? Uh, long story, but I, uh, I was basically trying to impress a professor at C uh, Central Michigan University. I told him I would try it, and been doing it ever since. And 27 years later, here we are. All right, tell me a little bit. Uh, some, what are some tips and tricks that you know? You know, I have no clue how to snow carve, or even where to begin. Kind of, what's the uh, tricks of the trade? Well, it all it all really begins with the gear. If you're not comfortable, if you're not warm, you're not working. So if you're not working, you're not getting anything done. So uh, dressing layers. There's many different tricks and tips that we have for our clothing uh, but once you get out here you have a plan and uh, you execute that plan and you just stay on target make your goals your daily goals your hourly goals and just keep moving if All you right. stop moving you get cold and you stop working <laughs> yeah definitely you don't want to freeze up so to speak uh, now tell us lastly what's your favorite part about partaking in this uh, by far the camaraderie I mean you don't come out you just come out here with uh, as many friends you see them every year um, once you share an experience like this something extreme like this you kind of have a bond with these people and uh, something to share every time you see them and it's it's just a lot of fun they're great people they're they're a lot of fun and besides that just you know working on something this big this with a scale like this it's just tremendous for an artist. All right, yeah, we're definitely going to be waiting to see your guys' art uh, in just a few uh, days, so thank you so much for waking up, and uh, they're getting to work on this, so we're going to let them, we're going to let him keep on and continuing on this, and uh, it's sturdy. Reporting live in Frankenmuth, Blake Keller, WNEM TV 5. Thank you, Blake. I cannot wait to check that one out and all of them. They look amazing out there. They're they do. Be so, it so makes great. me really want to go now yeah. to experience it for the right. first time. Yeah. Now, now, my thing would be